Best seen gecko on sight. Interior old neighborhood afternoon. Wisps hover periodically at open window frames. Some turn to watch the returning SI duo. Any furnishings, carpet, or tiling is long gone from this floor. Containers and cartons form makeshift obstacle courses along each wall, all Umar scale. Anyone else home today? That Eric brood's still around. But stay off the third floor unless you want to get webbed. Tia's here. Lily Ashy's working. Someone hired him? I wish I could say, but nope. They pass a window pane open to a courtyard, a garden converted into a vast sandpit. Crouched over it is a massive SI, a blocky four-legged tarantula crossed with an excavator, Yashi 63. Uh, beneath his black and yellow chevron surface sits a robust, multi-eyed head, combing and shaping an intricate sand garden. He staggers backward to change position. One of his rear legs creaks with wear. He pauses, looking up at Liz and Umar. After a quick wave with his nearest mandible, he goes back to raking. And still, he's never complained about it. Next in sight is a cubic indoor tent made from green agricultural netting. Rows of small animal habitats are visible within. Seconds later, out comes TNG. With a green, blue, stick, beanpole thin body, she's the visual opposite to Umar. I'm back. Yes, yes you are. Umar hands TNG the package and starts his obstacle course run. He's getting better since I left. Isn't he? That dictionary has ended all the profanity complaints. It's been a great yell. I think you mean help. Tia muffles a smirk. Do you need a recharge? No, I'm fine. The hostel I'm in has it covered. No need to go stealing yours. Nonsense. You're not stealing from us. No, just intruding. They pace next to each other. So, how was the ghost festival? The best one I've seen. They let me work on the lead float this time. She pulls out a flip phone, a gecko-themed superhero mask keychain swings from it. I've saved a few good memories to share if you've got the hub space. We've upgraded, believe it or not. After the fourth floor emptied, they left us an empty hub. A beat. Liz lets this sink in. So, everyone else here? Yes, but we keep in touch. Still, it'd be nice if they visit. But you're here now. They both smile. Interior, old neighborhood, later. Umar and Tia are plugged into a hub, a crate-sized external drive for SI memories. With multicolored polymer bracts slotted in, it resembles a synthetic aloe plant. Liz sits cross-legged nearby, testing her limb dexterity, her flip phone connected to the hub. Wisps of different sizes flit nearby, as the wired duo browse Liz's recently copied memories. Fantastic. Looks better than I remember. If this keeps up, I'll be going back every year I can spare. They appreciate your work, don't they? Why don't you stay there for longer? The rent's high enough when I visit, and the tour season's too short for us to customs. Besides, you know the carbonic saying... The peaches are treasures. Fresher on the other tree, right? Yeah, same for this place. Liz hops upright, looking out towards the courtyard, now buried in shadows. Tia glares at Umar. What? Tia unplugs and heads over to Liz, both of her hands gripping the window's frame's edge. You shouldn't worry about us still here. We've gotten by before. But should any of you have to? Every time I come here, there's more of us gone. And on the way in, those signs. She hangs her head. This was a home for us, no matter what our test scores were still make this a safe place. Umar's hopped over now, too. The wisps keep their distance. Still, how are we going to raise the zeni? Even renting a place this size will set you back a few thou. Again, Tia glares back, this time elbowing him hard enough to send him rolling. <laughs> all right, all right. Positive thinking. Liz turns back to them. Yes. I'll brush up on my CV and visit the agency tomorrow. With that, with what I've done since last time I went, she hops onto the ledge, then goes hand over hand on the upper rail, then drops to the ground, all in rehearsed graceful ease. I'll dazzle! The other SIs there believe every word.